I get this question a lot, man. How do you always have the best players when they come out? How do you get coins so fast? How are you able to build this team? No money spent. Well, it's easy. I just play the game. Honestly, that's honestly all I do. I just play the game. I'm going to show you what I do right now. Looking to build that guy squad you always wanted? Head on over to Discount Muck Coins for the cheapest, fastest, reliable coins. Use code MTG at checkout for 10% off your order. Yo, yo, what up guys? Welcome back to another Madden 20 Ultimate Team video back with the No Money Spent Squad. And like I said, man, I'm gonna show you pretty much how I get coins, man. Like, I did record some stuff, man, like, cause I've been playing Mutt Draft. Mutt Drafts is, that's just easy coins to me, honestly. Go 6-0, you get the coins, take the packs, take the coin packs, don't open the packs, just coins, coins, coins. That's like my first, first method right there, man. Like, I literally just play Mutt Drafts. I'm gonna show you right now on the screen, man. Here's some of my uh, earnings right here just from playing mud drafts. Like going 6 0, 6 0, 5 1. Most, you just want to go 5 1 or 6 0. Like the first two you see in are like I did those last week when I, before I got Julio. I needed to get Julio, didn't have the coins. I went like 5 1. I, I could have won the sixth game, but I gave it to a subscriber because he was playing me. The next one, I went 5 1. I lost the last game and I had enough coins to get Julio. And then I bought Julio, I sold Tyreek Hill, bought Julio Jones, add him to the squad. The next ones is just me playing again. I just need coins. I'm trying to get coins. I didn't do good in weekend league. Well, I did good, but I just wasn't able to finish. I only got 17, and I needed to finish, uh, like, two more games. So I only got 17 wins last week, so I only had, like, 270K or something like that before that. And then I just started playing mud drafts again, playing mud drafts again. And, yeah, I went 6-0. You can see that right here on the screen, 40K. And then, like, I just took all the coins. Took all the coins. And then, of course, I got the trophies. And then, I guess uh, it reset. But drafts reset. So, I was able to get these right here. Boom. That came in clutch right there. Definitely helped me with my trophies right there. So, definitely excited to have that right there, man. Uh, Yeah, that's pretty much how I do it. And uh, another way, um, you play your two games. Just play two games and then, you know, do your little. I think I already played two games because I've been playing butt draft today. That's how I got 400,000 coins right now. Uh, open this right here. You got to play, win two games, and then you open a pack, and boom. You're going to get you a, a quick sell for your daily objectives. And that's another way. Like, you seen on one of them, I had 50,000. I got 50,000 by opening uh, the daily objective. So, you know, these can be glitchy too. 6,000. Hey, 6,000 come in handy. Just by open, winning two games, playing two solos, winning and, and opening a pack. 6K. I'll take it all day. I'll take it all day. And sometimes I do go in the auction house and then, you know, I just kind of snipe stuff. See if I can snipe, you know, buy some, sell it, buy some, sell it. I do that, but that just take time. And honestly, it's boring. I just hate doing it. I'd rather just hop into a mud drafts, man, and just play a mud drafts. And then just go 6 0, take all the coins. And you get trophies too. So I'm trying to get trophies. So this mud drafts helps with that. I'm like, yo, this is just an easy way. I'm 5 0 right now. I just went, um, how am I 5 and 0? But oh, because it reset. It reset. So I was I went 6 and 0, but it reset. So when it only it's only showing 5 and 0 right there. But this is definitely an easy way. Just get into a rank draft. That's all I do. Boom, boom, boom. Get into a rank draft. Go 6 and 0. You'd be you'd be surprised. A lot of people can't stop dive. <laughs> halfback dive in mutt draft. They just can't. I, I literally ran halfback dive every single play. Every single play, I two clock every single play. They couldn't stop it. And then they just quit. They quit. And if they don't quit, you just turn on two clock. Run the clock all the way down. They're going to quit eventually. Or they just lose the game. And then all you got to do is play good defense. Blitz, blitz, play good defense. You win that game quick. That's just one of the methods I do when I want to get, like, quick coins, you know, real fast. I just play mud drafts. That's just, that's just what I do. Of course, I play, like... I haven't played solo. I only play solo battles when they do like the double rewards. That's it. If it's just regular, no, nah, I'm not doing it. I'm, that's just not me. I can't. I can't do it. I can't do it. And like, I do all the solo challenges. Like, cause you get good players from the solo challenges. Solo challenges, they give you good players this year. They definitely give you good players. I gotta finish the gauntlet. Well, the gauntlet, is that gauntlet too? Yeah, I need to finish this, man. So, uh, I actually gotta do my team of the week as well for that team of the year collectible. 
But yeah, I mean, you you play your solos, you get the coins, you get the uh, nat players. I mean, I know they changed that from a 95. That would have been see, that would have been fire if it was a 95 overall. That that would have been great. But who playing that for 89 overall? I don't want to do that. I'm just not. I'm just. I'm just not doing that. Playoff predictions right here. We do get a token. I think I, is this the one? I know one of these. They say you do. You play them and you get a. Uh, you get Titans Clan. Nah, that ain't it. I don't know. One of these is uh, you play like the wild card or something like that. And um, you get a collectible to upgrade your uh, Shazier or whoever you got as a team captain. So I'm going to do that too. But that's pretty much, man, playing the game. Literally, and, oh, playing the head-to-head, -head, of course. You play head-to-head, -head, you get an MVP and Legends. You get good coins for just getting wins. Just getting wins. And if you go 7-0 and then you make it to the playoffs, the trophies and the coins like that. Bro, it's good coins. It's good coins. Divisional goals, you get eight wins. Eight wins, you get a touchdown pack. So you get 65K or you can open the pack. You can't beat that. You, I, I'm telling you, you can't beat that. You just, you can't beat that. So I mean, like, play head to head. If you don't, if you don't like head to head, solo battles is where it's at. Play solo battles. It's just like weekend league. You know, it's just the wars ain't as high. But if you get number one, number two, like top 10 or whatever like that, you still straight. You straight, I just can't play solo battles. That's just, <laughs> that's just not me, man. But honestly, I just literally play the game. Play the game, man. But that's pretty much how I get coins. That's how you always see me upgrade my squad. And, like, I save cards, too. Like, I'll have cards just sitting in my binder and, like, hoping that they get an upgrade. Then I can sell that card if I don't want it. Or I just upgrade with that card that I already got. So, yeah, just hang on to cards. Don't be so quick to sell cards, especially if you know they're going to get another upgrade. Just hang on to them cards, man. This may be stuff you already know, but if you're new to the game and you really don't know, this is this is how I make coins. I mean, you probably already heard a lot of this stuff already, but people keep asking me. They just keep asking me, and so that's pretty much how I do it, man. But let's get to these weekend league rewards. I didn't get legend this. I didn't get legend last month because it's Christmas, man. I wasn't really playing like that, you know. Uh, I just really wasn't. I just really wasn't, man. I wasn't finishing like the weeks. 15 times gold player right here. I need this to be good right here. This it's, it was good last month. It was definitely good last month. Starting out with a 77 gold. Hey, right, come on, come on now, come on. All right, this is gonna be bad. It's gonna be bad. Heavyweight 90. Give me a 90. Okay, 88 Demar Dotson. I don't want you. <laughs> Elite 84 and a team of the week small piece right here. Uh, eh, it is what it is. It is what it is. Okay, we got an 83 plus right here. 83 plus fantasy pack number one. What you got for me? What you got for me? Give me some heat. Give me some heat, please. Okay, what's this? Bruh. Trash. <laughs> uh, 83. I thought that was actually going to be something good. I should have known it wasn't going to be nothing good. Come on, man. It's EA. 83. I'll go with... I'll go with Jamal Adams. I'll go with Jamal Adams. 83 plus... Y'all can't give me, like, no 90s in here? Come on, man. Come on, man. Don't do me like this, EA. 83-plus fantasy pack right here. Give me something good. Just, just give me anything good, man. I need a big anim. Okay, this is going to be another 83. 85, all right. Big X, what we got? 90 overall Steve Young. That man needs to get an upgrade. I'm going to hang on to this card because I think he's going to get an upgrade soon. And, uh, yeah, I'll be able to sell him or just use him, power him up, and switch to Steve Young. Uh, no, I'm not going to. Actually, I'm not going to use this card on uh, this account. Steve Young is going to be strictly for the Bucks theme team. But I'm definitely going to hang on to him because when he drops, I'm going to sell this card. I'll take that Steve Young for sure right there. Wasn't bad. Wasn't too bad. Uh, like I said, I wish I could have got Legend, but... You know, like I just, I just wasn't playing like that last week, last month. Let me show you the squad one more time before we get up out of here. Got Patrick Mahomes right here leading the way for us. Michael Irvin, Devin Hester right there. Uh, we got Ed, uh, Josh Jacobs here, Bo Jackson, Julio Jones, Tory Holt, Marquise Hollywood Brown. This is the offensive line. Uh, I think I want to go ahead and upgrade this Anthony Munoz to the to the full Anthony Munoz. Uh, Bruce Matthews, I don't know if he got another upgrade, but I think I should power up Jason Kelsey. Um, just start upgrading these players. Uh, Travis Kelsey do got another card, and that card looked really, really good. Really, really good. Defense side of the ball. My defense stack, man. Like, for me, I like defense more than I like offense. That's why I always pick up more defensive players than I do on offense. And the defense always look better than my, my offense. But my defense, I love it. 
we looking solid out here, man. It's just the squad just looking nice. Real, real nice. Daniel Hunter, I'm definitely gonna get that new Daniel Hunter. Cause he fast and just having him at the spy. That's just gonna be clutch. He gonna be he gonna be clutch at the spy. So definitely liking that card there. Y'all let me know who we upgrade next. What position deserves that upgrade? What do we upgrade next? Y'all let me know down below in the comment section. Just let me know and I'll do my best to pick up that player, man, and bring him to the squad. I see y'all boys in the next upload, man. I'm out.